here we go. Something new, something different. Dave to Diver time. Story time. Oh, Dave, you got here quickly. <laughs> well, I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. <laughs> so, where's the sushi at? <laughs> ah, 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 don't rush yourself. Have a look around. <laughs> look at this giant blue hole. I've never seen anything like this. <laughs> it's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. Which means... This could be an incredible business opportunity! Yeah. What kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I already took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and go on in. Hmm... I don't have a good feeling about this. Prologue. Sushi bar by the blue hole. Ah, uh, it appears that I am still connected in the Discord. There we go. Nice form! Ha 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 ha! Alright, how about you try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. With left trigger, you can move quickly. Remember that this speeds up oxygen consumption. Good, looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. Let's not practice using the new weapon you will need in contingencies. The dive knife. Try using a survival knife on small fish. You can use the B button. Well done. Smooth and quick. 
and finally have forgotten how to use a harpoon, have you? <laughs> a harpoon? Well, haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first, and then... Hmm... Uh, looks like you'll need some practice. Let's try using a harpoon to catch, let's say, three fish. Aim with A, and fire with the right trigger. Now try it yourself. I think that should get you back on track in no time. Alright, come back up to the boat. Okay, now that you got the hang of it, let's get down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? For sure. That sawfish meat with oily rice. Oh man, that's just the best. Ah, well, listen up. I have a friend who is a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he has one skill that I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend and sells one-of-a-kind sushi. Hello, Dragon. Yeah, I saw your DMs in the Discord. I was gonna type that my GTX 1650 was kinda hot. Power World is making this little graphics card struggle. It was dropping a lot of frames, so I had to switch games. Still, thanks for the company and a cordial welcome. I really appreciate the good times. Let's create a team on Sorry. Sushi sold here is made from fresh fish caught in a blue hole, where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people would just go nuts for it? Yum. I'm already craving it. Aha, uh -huh, I bet so. Why don't you join in on this awesome venture as well? What do you say? I mean, I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Nothing to worry about. The restaurant is all ready. All you need to do is dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad, right? So I can eat as much sushi as I want? Yeah, sure. You have to pay though. I can't wait to check it out! The sushi restaurant next to the blue hole! It was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Ha ha ha! Let's go. Hey, Mancho! Are y'all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. Mm. Oh, it's already finished? Mm. You? Ah, you're the fisherman Cooper was talking about. Mm. Well, I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. Mm. All right, anyway, it's nice to meet you. I'm Bancho. Mm. So you like sushi? I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Oh boy. Just thinking about it, it makes my mouth water. <laughs> hmm. Just as mediocre as expected. <laughs> Sushi is a food that combines the soul of sea and land. It civilizes Mother Nature herself. <laughs> Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish just like you. <laughs> How empty your life is the one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. <laughs> my calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone. <laughs> Oh, it's an earthquake! Ooh. An earthquake? Hmm. Mm. The interior is really quite a mess. Ooh. Yeah, looks like we will have to delay the opening today. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair costs through doing business. In this state? Wahaha! <laughs> In the end, the importance of a restaurant is a taste. First, we need the ingredients. Did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Only three fish? This won't be nearly enough to serve the guest. Please go catch seven more fish first. 
Oh, and the restaurant is going to be open only in the evening. Hmm? Won't that decrease sales? You think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little more money? It is a chef's duty to pair the best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a whetstone. You will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Okay. It seems Mancho really is passionate about his work. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. Wahahaha! <laughs> I haven't seen Mancho so enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. The incident? Oops, maybe I shouldn't have bought it up. Well, anyway, we need more ingredients. So go catch seven fish. Seven fish it is. Those are not fishes. That one is. That's a seahorse. Oh no, I can't catch it. And it bounces. Yellowback Fusilier. jellyfish and that's an eel right there that eel wants to take a bite out of me an agar critical deaths Oh! I didn't see these tiger fishes! so far. Well, it doesn't even tell you. That's more than enough.
All right, looks like you caught, caught quite a few. At this rate, we'll make boatloads of money in no time. <laughs> my, my, would you look at the time? We have to hurry up and get things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? Dive log, caught 10. Obtained seven stuff. Three ore and four planks. By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Get the ingredients ready before the dinner hour starts. What do you have to say for yourself? Come to think of it, it's already been around eight years that we've known each other. I was having diving fun back when... La 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 la. I need to drink water. I was having fun diving back then near Richelieu Rock. We certainly wanted to get your suitcase that fell off the boat. Ha ha ha! I thought I was a real trouble back then. I was working as a weapon dealer. And then there were important blueprints in a suitcase. Luckily, you saved them before they could be ruined. I have no idea how I would have fought Hans Lindemann without the blueprints. Hans Lindemann? Oh, I was talking to myself. Don't mind me. <laughs> Bancho, how are the preparations coming along? I see. Hmm, I think we're mostly set. That's good. Here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're to help me run the sushi bar from today onwards. <laughs> what? I... I don't understand. <laughs> Cobra told me that there would be somebody to help with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do is cook. <laughs> and who else is there for that but you? <laughs> Wait, I never worked at a restaurant before. <laughs> the guests will be here soon. I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. <laughs> what? <laughs> Open ingredients below. <laughs> Here you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and all of the materials you have. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. Alright, now I'll show you how to register actual items to the menu. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. There's a sushi recipe for the fish you acquired earlier, so try registering that to the menu. Alright, that probably wasn't that hard. <laughs> Setting ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. <laughs> Let me repeat. Only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you have to replace the, them items on the menu to, or refill the ingredients. <laughs> you can also enhance the flavor of the dishes. So try it out when you have enough ingredients. <laughs> now, use the ingredients you caught to fill out the menu as much as you can. This? Nope, it doesn't let me. Here we go. How long are you gonna stand there talking? Give me a cup of green tea to quench my thirst. Hmm. Have you perhaps poured green tea before? No, only soft drinks, I think. <laughs> I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. Mm -hmm. First try, let's go. Wahaha! <laughs> As expected, Boncho's green tea is quite something. Hmm, that tea really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? <laughs> Demanding as always. Why don't you try sorting him some food while you're at it? <laughs> Come over to where I am and take this food. Uh-huh. 
Hello. You sent the package last week, you see? What in the world? Let me check in on that. Cobra didn't even eat. He's always distracted like that. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. Seems like such a waste to throw it away. Bacho Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Well, all right. Everything looks about ready. Hmm. I haven't cooked for customers in a kind of while. Kind of nervous. Don't forget to press Y after filling the menu for business to begin. Okay. I could enhance this. But then again, I already put the ingredients on the table. Want to close sushi close for the day. Five and a half stars. Phew. Work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. Try a little harder next time. I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. <laughs> a man should not feel gratification from simple compliments. Yeah, yeah, all right. In any case, a toast to the opening of Bancho Sushi. Taco Ron Ron pulling boats again? Oh, who is this? Hmm, are you the man who's been diving around here? Yeah, I think so. Tch, I was expecting a more professional looking guy. I can hear, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? I'm Ellie. I study biology at the local graduate school. I've come out to investigate after reports of anomalies in the area. Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? I like to study the ecology of this blue hole. Get me some agar and red starfish first. 
I don't think it's a good idea to ask for just one of each. Get me two of each. Your tone makes me want to refuse. Hmm. I got a reward, but if you don't want it, that's fine by me. A reward? Well, I wasn't refusing. I'm just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry. Don't dally. Red ecological data. Well, it's a fine morning for some diving. Let's go. Let's make that money. What I just cut, it's a dead fish. Orbicular bad fish. Turmeric. Gotta throw away that fish because it's dead. Oh. What is that? Oh shit! Ow! Titan Triggerfish. Well, if it was a live capture, it would have yielded a lot more meat. Look at that, a bugar. That's two bugars. More wouldn't hurt. Oxygen capsule for extended divings. It hurts! I don't think sea urchins can be picked up with these gloves. That's a puffer fish. Ah, it's a toy hammer! Now I am overburdened. What is... Sort by weight? Titan Triggerfish only gets me one piece of meat because it's dead. Yeah, live captures gets me double the meat. fish.
close our agars, I still gotta find one more red starfish, wherever that could be. Another oxygen capsule. Never say no to that. Oh, there it is, the last starfish. Nice. doesn't end until Dave is too heavy to move, even though he's already rotund. anymore. Time to go back to the boat. Hmm, you actually brought them back? I guess I expected too little of you. Alright, this should do for now. I'll give you a reward as promised, since you helped me do my research. Sudden ecological changes in our region will need to be studied further, so I'll continue to need your services. Add my number! Soy sauce, olive oil, and 70 gold pieces. Oh, Dave, you collected 100 gold! Great job! This should be enough to repair what's broken. <laughs> then give you some time. These repairs need to be done right. I really hope the customers keep coming. Nice. <clears throat> Dave, did you get to loosen up yesterday? Mm. Mm, I saw a lot of nasty fish. It won't be easy to go any deeper. Uh, I did notice that the fish in the blue hole have an odd violent streak. Perhaps something puts them on edge? Speaking of which, why don't you also take a gun in addition to the harpoon? A gun? I have a friend who's knowledgeable about guns. I'll introduce you to him. Wow, Cobra. It's been a while. Who's the goofy looking guy next to you? Sorry, that wasn't the nicest thing to say to a stranger. I'm Dave, a professional diver. Interesting. I thought divers were athletic and muscular. You seem to defy my prior knowledge. People who live in glass houses. So what's this about? I'd like you to get straight to, to the point. I begin a very interesting business. Ha ha ha! And now I'm in need of some weapons, Duff! I need your help. Hmm, season two of Strastella just ended anyway. I'll give you a listen. Alright, I actually discovered a fascinating giant blue hole. The terrain and ecology inside it changes every time you go inside. Oddly, any equipment found inside breaks down when brought out. I'd like you to make us a weapon that can't be used inside. Hmm, that is rather interesting. You've piqued my interest as a weapon researcher, you could say. My hypothesis is that anything that's not made from materials found in the blue hole will continue to break down. 
This will be especially true of guns, which have precision parts. Hmm. So we'll have to get materials from the sea ourselves. Heh. <laughs> Dave, you'll have to prove yourself as a diver to this Master Duff. I'm not sure why I should have to prove myself to you. Just tell me what you need. Since it appears you have no guns at all, let's start with something easy. I think I'll need one rope and one scrap iron. You heard him right, Dave? Into the blue hole and bring back some rope and scrap iron. By the way, if you run out of oxygen midway, you'll only be able to make it back with one item. Always keep that in mind. <sighs> well, here we are in the afternoon. Operator? Hello! I hope you're having a great day! Please note that this call is being recorded for quality assurance! What can I help you with today? Um, what is this? You've chosen to claim a reward! Please enter the promotion code! Oh shit, I don't know it! What's today's fortune? You've chosen to hear your fortunes for today! Here it is! Happiness dwells in your mundane life! Diligence is a key, or so it says. That's it for today's fortune telling. Is there anything you need? Nah, no, that's it. Thank you for calling. Please don't hesitate to call us again. That's hilarious. What about... Boncho? How's the shop looking? What is it? Do you want to learn to cook, perhaps? No, I just came to see if you need any particular ingredients. A master chef can cook with any ingredient. I'll show you the best food possible, regardless of what you bring me. Just bring me lots of it. Hmm. Ellie? What is it? I'm at the library right now. Calling me so suddenly? Where are your manners? Click! <laughs> I mean, Cobra is right there, right besides me. Well, back into the waters. Let's find a rope and scrap iron. It won't hurt to get some extra wood and oars and planks. It's moving! Well, I guess I can't do nothing with that until later on in the game, I guess. Ow! Scrap iron. There we go. And that's a Titan trigger fish, and it saw me! Nope!
where did I see an oxygen tank at? Oh, there it is. What? What? Cheap Japanese sword. That's a lot of blue tangs. That's a Titan Trigger Fish. Along with two Tiger Fishes right there. Those things are aggressive. Oh, what is this? A Raid from Dragon himself. Hello, Chatters. Hello, hello, hello. Well, come on in, everybody! Bossy, hello. Nice to see you again. That was really fun, exploring the bases and whatnot, catching pals left and right. Well, let's see if this Frosty Tools can do the auto shout-out. Because I said it right, and for some reason, the options just keeps keeps on resetting. If not, I could always just return back to the ship. Either way, I'm already full. Here we go, I got a free hand. Here we go! Shout out! Oh, and Season Dragon is here to inspire and entertain, to find the odds with Arthur Gryposis. Catching Critters and Power by Day 42, they're all about family vibes and chilling beats. Is this a repeat? Ah, oh, I thought it was different each time that I do a shout out. Either way, fix again for the raid! Here we go. Command and built in. Alright, so let's continue on with the story. Duff says, Well, to think you actually managed to bring it back. I expected you to quietly expire in the debts, you could say. Huh. Mossy. Alright, thank you. I understand that. No worries, you just go on ahead and rest. And thanks for the follow. Duff says, I expect you to quietly expire in the depths, you could say. <laughs> Seems I have underestimated you slightly. Very well. I'll show you how to make the basic underwater rifle with these materials. First of all, download Duff's weapon shop on your phone. It's well optimized. Only 42 megabytes, you could say. Okay, let's craft this gun. Wow. 
<laughs> Heh, with a neat explanation like that, even someone like you should have understood. Okay. Well, I guess. Yeah. Oh, and one more thing. <laughs> I've taken some measure to allow you to open weapon chests underwater. Oh. Wow, weapon chests? <laughs> you can't bring them out of the sea, but they can still come in handy, you could say. Yeah. Oh, but I'll collect info about the weapons you pick up and create blueprints for you. Sure. Weapons made with a blueprint will break down underwater, you could say. In any case, this master will be watching you. Goodbye, Eternity! <laughs> nice. <clears throat> it's night time. Time to sell stuff at the sushi shop. Wow, that's a lot of blue tangs. <laughs> that poor little fishy. Okay, this one's level five. We're gonna put some blue tang on the table. Level that up. Culinary master achievement. Um Level this up, level that up. Okay. Cardinal fish. Well, the blue tang is going to be a high seller. All right. Let's see, we set up the menu. Why is it one out of one? Auto supply. Manage add ingredients. Oh, that explains it. Ah, uh, just wanna make sure. Everything looks good. It's time to open the shop. You want some tea? I'll give you some tea. Here's your sushi. Hang on a minute, sir. I got you. Nice. Who wants this? Okay. Who ordered this? I'll get it to you, sir. Here you go. Dish. 
No one ordered the tang. Well, just one. Huh, well, at least I got five star. Top sales was a rainbow rust. Top sales in the last seven days, a blue tang. Okay, so they prefer the rainbow rust then. Dr. Bacon, are you Dave by any chance? No. Yes? What is it, sir? <laughs> wow! I'm always right about these things! Ha <laughs> ha! Nice to meet you. I'm Dr. Bacon. I'm an archaeologist who studies the Sea People Civilization. <laughs> the Sea People Civilization? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! I'll explain it to you. Aren't you lucky to have an expert like me to tell you all about them? <laughs> uh, maybe I shouldn't have asked. Sea people civilization lives in legends. They are said to have occupied this region a very long time. What the? Hey, this thing's going by way too fast! I'm not even pushing any buttons, but whatever. That's all there is to the story. Everyone thinks it's a myth and nothing more, of course. But proof that they were real was found right in the vicinity of this place! Huh? This is an amazing find. One that could turn a whole academic world upside down. An ancient civilization under the sea. You'd only see such things in comic books or games. What makes you so sure they are real? My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found that it's from no known civilization. It's dated around 1,500 years ago as well. There were no civilization in these parts back then. Hmm, that is interesting. But what business do you have with me? Well, you see, my assistant's cryptocurrency investments didn't pan out and he won't be around for a good while. That's why I like you to help me. Oh. My assistant told me that the artifact was found 70 meters or below above the surface. Please go take a look. We're busy with the sushi bar. I don't think we can. Haha, <laughs> sorry to interrupt the conversation. I'm Cobra. I work with Dave. Of course, we should help you. We'll gladly do so. Yeah, ha, ha. What? We don't have the time to swim around searching for artifacts. Think about it. If an underwater civilization is discovered, countless people will flock here. Bato Shushi will be bursting at the seams. Um, I suppose you have a point. All right, I'll help. Haha, <laughs> isn't that lucky? Oh, of course, I won't be asking you to work for free. I'll upgrade the diving suit you're wearing for free. Wow! With an enhanced diving suit, you'll be able to venture deeper. This is essential for exploration. These days, even such things can be handled by an app. Technological advancements are amazing, eh? First, let's install the iDiver app on the phone before we proceed. The eye diver. Now then, let me tell you how to use the eye diver. I'll install the app for you, so unlock your phone first. Mm hmm. 80 meters is the limit. Good! Now you will adventure a deep bit deeper. Once you have enough money, use eye diver to enhance your equipment. You can enhance your suit as well as your cargo box and oxygen tank. Never forget that anything can happen in deep waters. I'll be in touch. Chat traces of the sea people. Let's see, I have 83 pieces of gold. Old harpoon gun, and that's a. It upgrades to the steel gun. That's what I want more cargo. Alright! Let's go diving!
apples are blue tangs, people don't want to eat them. Rainbow Rase. Oh! They got away. A weapon box. Shock Harpoon. Mediterranean Parrotfish. What's in this box? than a knife, better than nothing. Lagoon Tigerfish. And that one's a shortcut back home. Got you! Tip level two, and this one is like what? A level one? Yeah. Kill them? No, it doesn't. Those red triangle thingies on the fishes it signifies that they're aggressive. Fish. Those things yield a lot of meat. Three pieces of meat. Yep. What is that? That? God, those things are coming at me. So this means that my cargo box can't fit anymore. Yep, I am overburdened. Escape pod. This one is your shortcut back home. <laughs> the biggest fish, seventy centimeters. Mediterranean. Whoa, this thing yields a lot of meat. So does this. Hmm. Hello. Dave, while you were out at sea, the repairs are completed. Hello. Let's head to the restaurant. Mm. Wow. 
it's looking very nice. <laughs> ah, ah, it doesn't matter how delicious the food is, the restaurant can't be a mess. <laughs> ah, if you want to change the interior, the interior mail below is open, so please check it. <laughs> ah, but... <laughs> As Arthur Bacon said, if the remains of the sea people are found here, customers will indeed come, but... This area is kind of remote, so I think Long will need a way to advertise the store until then. Mm. Yeah, these days it's just about impossible to attract customers without publicity. Mm. Ah, have you tried the social media app named Cooksta? Mm. You mean, social media app young people use to post pictures of the food they eat? Yeah, that's how all businesses are programming themselves lately. I simply can't understand why people would waste their time like that. Sushi makes an impression on the heart, not photographs. Hmm. Even so, isn't it better to use it than to keep people ignorant of your food, Boncho? You have a point there. Making an account is simple, so let's try it out. You first register and make the hashtag Bancho Sushi, then... Done! Hmm, well, it's not as complicated as I expected. Now customers happy with their food will follow Bancho Sushi. Hmm, I'm not so sure about this, but okay, I got it. I'll also install the Cooksta app on my phone and check the followers post. Cooksta! Uh-huh. The interior. Cooksta. Ten followers. Bancho Sushi. Is this how you take a profile picture? It's hard. <laughs> Bancho Sushi Bar is grand opening. You've never tasted sushi like this before. Reasonable prices and great service. Open only in the evenings. Yeah, give it a likes. This one is just a repeat scene. Interior, normal wood table, oriental modern. Decos, Cobra's picture. It's staring at you. Meow. Meow. Oh, that's adorable. <laughs> ah, ah, things are looking good. <laughs> if you want to change a different style, try changing the interior menu. Okay. How you doing? <clears throat> are the ingredients preparation going well? Get the menus ready before the operating hours. We gotta go back to the boat. It is the afternoon. Let's go for a dive. Starry Puffer. It's a dolphin. Mm. 
Huh? A dolphin? Hmm. It seems to be asking me to follow. Should I try and follow? A dolphin's request. All right, lead the way, dolphin. What is that? Red to tide trigger fish. What is that? Long fish. It's a long fin bat fish. Oh, a pink dolphin is caught in a net. So it was asking me to rescue its friend. I should cut that net. seems to have left a gift. I didn't even know Dolphin had mates. Pearl. Fragment. What's in here? Tranquilizer Harpoon. Oh, what was it telling me to do? What the hell? Well, that's convenient. I could have just picked it up. Uh, is that the artifact? It's glass. Triple Axel. Oi, that's a spiked wall right there.
still gotta find that artifact, wherever it is. That must be it. Is that a... Is that a Sano Shark? Oh, Dave, I think that's the one. Come back to the boat safely. I'll be waiting. Oh, what is that? That's a Kraken! Was that just now? Mm -hmm. I have to go back to the boat right away. <laughs> Dusky Groper. It's a three star. And I am overburdened. What exactly is the heaviest item I got? This one. A kilograms. Huh. Ah. What is this? A skull. that oxygen tank right there. If I remember correctly, I thought I saw an escape pod to the right. Yep, there it is. And these squids are just jizzing on my face. Here we are. You brought it out safely! It seems to be in very good condition. Almost as if it was stored somewhere until recently. Hmm, very interesting. This may be the find of the century, even. Alright, Dave. Let's continue to work together and uncover the secrets of the Sea People civilization. What? I thought I'd be only be helping you once. <laughs> of course! Say no more! Just put our restaurant at the top of the list of affiliates. That won't be hard to do. I have a very lucky feeling about this. I'll be in touch. That's a lot of gold pieces. The biggest fish, Dusky Groper. Red to trigger fish. This one is 16 pieces. I could just level that up and sell it. <clears throat> it's already evening. <clears throat> I feel stiff. Even so, Boncho's working alone. I should probably help. <clears throat> it's not easy to manage with two people with more customers coming in. Not enough workers.
Who's this? This is Bancho's sushi place, huh? Hmm. Miss Yoshi. I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cooksta. They name gave me pause, but to think it's really your place. New food using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. A taciturn but masculine chef. Wow! Did they mention me too? No, not really. Ugh. In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? Oh, various reasons. I want to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well, there's nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day, training myself. My goodness! That is a problem! You refused to listen to me the last time in a similar fashion, and that's what you got booted from the hotel. You're talking about that again. That's a customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. How long will you continue treating customers that way? To keep making that terrible food. What do you mean terrible? Whole roasted shark head is an excellent dish. Shark has been used in cuisine in both the West and the East, and in Korea it was even used in ancestral rituals. Stop! You've not changed one bit. Let me judge for myself then whether it's food fit for consumption. Then I can tell you why I came. Fine then. I'll show you. I'll make sure you know the true taste of shark head meat. Bancho, isn't this development a bit sudden? Dave, as a chef, this is a fight I can't back out of. My pride hangs in the balance. Please get me a white tip reef shark head and olive oil. You want me to catch a white tip reef shark? Yes. With your skills, it should be easy enough to do. But a harpoon's not likely to be enough. Take a good gun with you into battle. Even so, fighting a shark sounds way too dangerous. Do you mean to say you'll just stand by and watch my Baba Pride get trampled? The white tip reef shark is usually found in the ocean far to the right. Good luck. He suddenly wants me to get him a shark head. This is preposterous. And it can only be killed with a gun? Mm. I'll have to ask Duff to make me a gun, or search for one in the blue hole. Special customer. For research. Hmm. I already got this. Dusky Groper. Well, I can't level this up just yet. Nor this. I'm gonna put that in the menu. I'm gonna put not this in the menu yet, but I'll sell it either way. This one's level three. This one's level one. That should be good. And open! I gotta go get a shark.
Yes. Hey, Dave! I got the luckiest news! What is it, Dr. Bacon? You look happy. I analyzed that artifact you brought me and a large amount of an unknown substance was detected. I think it must be iron compressed deep underwater, but it gives off a unique wavelength. I went ahead and developed a radar to track those waves. Oh? And why is that news lucky? Haha! -ha, being coy today, are we? This radar is bound to come in useful on your next expedition. What do you mean my next expedition? Cobra forced me to go along last time. Mm, I was given a contract with your name on it. Cancellation charge for breaking the contract is over 20... What? What in the world were you two talking about? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> don't be so by the book. Check the signal for me to test out the radar. <sighs> Give it to me. I'll tell you if it works and no more. Signal from the sea people. <laughs> Cooksta. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the strange guy serving it though. Fuck you. <laughs> My man, I want to call Ellie and say, what the fuck, girl? Okay, Dr. Bacon. What is it? Did you discover something new? That's not it. I see. Tell me if you see anything peculiar, whatever it may be. Okay. Time to dive. Is this another triple axle? Cheap Japanese sword. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Red lionfish. Tranquilizer hardware tip. Ah. That one's asleep. That one's asleep. Not dead, but this one is.
Sharky's right there. I'm gonna boop you in a snoot. There we go. Booped him in the snoot. Now what is this? Oh, I can't carry it. Green hump fit parafish. I am now overburdened. I got a Ted. I got a piece of its meat. Fortunately, I seem to be overburdened. I'm just gonna have to lose one of these things. Dragon Ball Radar now that I see the resemblance. Where does it lead me to? Wow, so this is the place. Let's see. Hmm, the signal is coming from inside. There are letters I've never seen before written on the pillar. Hmm. If we had some tool of some sort, we could move aside that pile of rocks and try going inside. I think it would be best to talk this over with Cobra. Come on up over now. Huh? Hmm, I thought I heard something. That's an aggressive fish. Oh, I'm running out of air. Where did I see an oxygen tank? There it is. escape pod and there's another trigger fish oh that's right that's right I found a place with a signal from the Sea People Civilization. I can't hold back my academic thirst to check it out! I'm at an important symposium right now. Please talk it over with Cobra first. I'll come by tomorrow. Huh. How to get rid of rock piles? You'll have to use a bomb, of course! <laughs> Is it okay to detonate bombs underwater? Weren't you talking about a rock pile somewhere deep below? I'm sure it'll be fine. 
<laughs> Let's put a little trust in his C's regenerated power. Yeah. He's trying to gloss things over again. But there's an issue. The delivery ships haven't been arriving lately. I need to get delivery from a bomb expert, I know. Apparently the ship's gone off the radar. I think it's sunk. If I could use a drone I order, we could retrieve the supplies. Dave, could you go into the sea and retrieve drone materials? Drone materials? How am I supposed to find them in the ocean? It's huge! Delivery boxes are likely have been carried by the ocean currents. Look for a place with ocean currents. Hmm, that sounds dangerous. Who's that? <laughs> Hoppity hop! <laughs> Yo! Do you know a lot about this giant blue hole? <laughs> well, I'm not sure what to say to that. It's different than there every time. <laughs> yes, that's it! It's the best place to collect Marinka! <laughs> I could complete my collection in this place! Aha! <laughs> Marinka? <laughs> what? Don't tell me you don't know the highly popular Ocean Life trading cards, Marinka! Hmm. How can you not have heard the futuristic trading cards that utilize an AI recognition system that automatically corresponds to fish in real life? Um, I never heard of them. Sounds fun though. Ah, oh, you seem quite behind the times. Let me help you install the app. Hmm. So you do this, then press here, touch that, add a friend, <laughs> done! I'm um, okay, so what do I do now? Hmm. The amazing thing about these Marinka is... You don't really need to do anything special! <laughs> Just catch a new fish and you'll get a card. Check the cards every now and then on the app and you're done. <laughs> I see. I guess I'll be able to easily see what fish I caught so far. <laughs> That's right. It's almost like a... <laughs> Whoa, you don't want to be saying the name. I understand. I'll try it out. <laughs> oh, I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? I'm Sato. I'll give you my contact info, so hit me up if you have questions. See you then! Choo choo! Marinka. Huh. So I'm guessing gold ranked fish is they produce some more meat. Can be crafted. Oh my god, this is just a repeat. Nope. Eye Diver. I do need a new suit. And an air tank. And a cargo box. What do I have in here so far? Gun that fires three bullets at once. Its shots are powerful but cannot pierce. This one has shorter range than this, and yet. This one helps me kill the shark. There's no way I could sell the extra things? No, I don't think so. Lady's not here. <laughs> nice. 
Nice. Ba -ba 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 -ba. If I were to put that on the dish right now, but then again, it's not the evening. I'll be catching even more fish. Yeah, I catch more of the shark. Hello, kitty. I love you too, Momo. Here we go. Enhanced heart moon tip. A baseball bat. No good, Captain. Japanese sword. At least it's quicker than the baseball bat. <laughs> Talk about wall banging the fish. Imagine that. What's this? Gun enhancement kit? Time 
trigger fish is captured. I got five pieces of each of these things. Uh-huh. Those things are definitely money makers. Ooh, another Titan trigger fish. You're mine. underwater scooter <laughs> and yet I'm already done for today One shark head coming right up. this and the dusky groper should I even keep this Wow I'll just upgrade it for now and serve that I think I cannot go back. Okay. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Here she is. You'll get your shark head. Disgusting as usual. The look of it just ruins my appetite. Even so, a promise is a promise. Wow. How do you like it? It's good. It's tasty. I can taste the white tip reef shark fat inside the crispy whole roast. But it's not an overly cloying flavor. Is this is ginger? This ginger scent mixes with the strong flavor of the head. It's quite lovely. <laughs> Pardon me. I wasn't expecting it to be this good. 
Book of Five Rings states that one should look at the essence of something instead of its appearance. Sharks look terrible on the outside, but they have robust meat and their head has a delicious taste. This whole roasted shark head brings such treats to their maximum potential. I must admit it. This is good. You pass, Bancho. Let me tell you why I'm here then. This restaurant needs to hire people. I can help you with that. Huh? What do you mean? Do you still mean to go it alone, Bancho? This place is already operating at full capacity. Things might be okay for now, but you'll be able to cope when even more customers come. I can't continue working alone, but it's not easy to find people I can trust. I'm Yoshi the Recruiter. This is what I do these days. Let's start by putting out a hiring ad. Employees. Nice. Ahem. Let me tell you how to recruit staff. Pay close attention to what I say. Uh-huh. Flyer ad. Good. The recruitment results become available the following day. I'll tell you more tomorrow. If this guy wants a shark head, he'll get it. Hang on, lady. I'll get your green tea. I mean, guy. These guys have expensive taste if they like shark head that much. Bronze! Nice. There you go. Here, have some shark head. Have some of this. That's a lot of money. Oh, this rude girl. I wonder what she wants. Hey, you haven't quit diving yet, have you? Um... What is it this time? Um, I'm doing some investigation for an important paper. I'm going to need some help. Get me three blue shells and three brown shells. Okay. Okay, but aren't you supposed to do this sort of thing yourself? Are you kidding me? Writing a paper requires a ton of research and investigation. What you're doing is only a very tiny part of it all. So don't let it get to your head. Hurry along. I don't have much time until the deadline. You really are impossible. Mm. But since you say it's for a paper, was it blue shells and brown shells? Yeah. Cooksta. And a whole bunch of uploads. In Silas. Heard shots like this are the trend now. This fish is poisonous, but it tastes good, actually. <laughs> Queen Chan! Hello, what's up? We receive an award, please come visit. The shark head. It's good, but I can't get over the way it looks. It's a bit less gross on camera, so here it goes. And now to get this. <laughs> I 
Eye Diver. Air tank and a cargo box. Need to carry more stuff. Everything looks good for now. So, Queenie, how's your evening going so far? Was playing Pal World earlier. But it would appear that more complicated the buildings are since I visited a friend's server. My poor graphics card was suffering. It was slogging down and overheating. So I switched to this. It's a dolphin. Aha, uh -huh, you must be the dolphin from before. Why does it look like it's in a hurry? I wonder if something's going on. Come to think of it, I don't see the pink dolphin this time. I should follow. Yeah, I gotta get myself an RTX card. Because this 1650, it's reaching its limits. Oh no! The dolphin is caught! the pink dolphin. Pirates must have captured it illegally. I should quickly cut its net. gift. I hope neither of them gets caught again. A large gold bar. And it weighs two kilograms. Oh, a blue seashell. Titan trigger fish! Get over here! Got you. This one has three units of meat. Another blue shell. I mean brown shell. Over here. Oh. Get over here. Long fin batfish. What's in here? Oxygen tank. Oh, that's a shark. Come here, I'm gonna boop you in a snoot.
that's a parrotfish. It's just chilling, minding its own business. What are you? Chill, bruh. That's a barracuda. It's bitey. There's no way I can capture it, can I? A great barracuda. It's a three star. That's enough brown shells. Now to look for two more blue shells. That's a puffer fish. Those assholes again. What's in here? Nice. A level two harpoon. That right there is an escape pod. I'll make a note of that in case I need to make a quick retreat. What is this? Football. Soy sauce. Is that a sawbone shark? Oh. Long nose saw shark. And looks like I see one of the critical components I need to make a drone. Ah, that's what it is ocean currents. A gray barracuda. It's just one piece of meat for sale of seven milligrams. It's not worth it. Drop it. one camera lens motor oxygen tank what what should be one more critical piece in this area there it is Currents. Okay. Computer chip. What's this? Iron ore. Nice. I want to dive further down, but I'm not so sure this suit could will be able to withstand the pressure. Are those rig wigglers? Skull. Look at that, they are wigglers. Okay. 
I got his head. Five units of shark meat. And plenty of loot to sell. I'm already carrying a lot of things, so let's go to an escape pod. Could have sworn I saw one up here. There it is. It's a shortcut back home. What is that, though? Is that a tuna? Get over here! I missed! That thing doesn't want to go! It knows it's about to be sushi! There we go, get it here! Ah! Um, it's dead. Giant Trevely meets. Well, looks like it was too big to carry home, so I had to carve it. Okay. I mean, that's what the drone is for. Is there anything else over here before I go home? What's that? Over here, Fishy. Harlequin Hind. And that's it. I can't fit any more in my cargo box. Phew, that was harder than I expected. These are hard to find. Well, this isn't bad. Now then, if I just complete the delivery to Eco Watcher. Ta da! Haha, -ha, research level gained. Huh? Eco Watcher? Oh, you don't know? Eco Watcher is a mission based app made to protect the environment. You get points for completing missions on that app and get rewards for reaching certain levels. So, this was for points on that app. Not for a paper. Oh, uh, well, you could say they're basically the same thing. You could try it out too if you're interested. See you! God, she's so manipulative. Alright, we should deploy a drone with this. Hmm? You look pretty exhausted. Ha ha ha. Well, the sea currents did knock me around a bit. Ha <laughs> ah, ha, I see. It'll take a bit of time to repair the drone and deploy it. Please wait a while. Should be done by tomorrow morning. Go about your business until then. <laughs> nice. The diving suit... And that's a default harpoon gun. I haven't even upgraded this yet, but I'm gonna miss out on a diving suit. There we go. Huh, so I already have these things. Remove jellyfish, overpopulated invasive fish. Research marine plants. 
Delivered. Delivered. Level two. Eco health bracelets. Gotta find leg bone. Let's see. Pink seashell. Kill fried egg jellyfish. Five of these assholes. That jumps me if it sees me. Kelp Kajime. Where have I seen the kelp? That's like... Below 70 meters. The weapon shop. Basic underwater rifle. Nope. So, it turns out the harpoon gun is needed indeed to catch those fish. Okay. <sighs> it's the afternoon. We could just go for one more dive. Cobra shop? What is this? My package hasn't arrived and it's been a while. I wonder what's wrong. Recently picked it up from the floating remnants of a wrecked boat. There must have been some kind of accident. A sudden accident in this isolated blue hole. I think I saw a huge squid a while ago. It's not because of that, is it? A giant squid. Just about anything can happen here. Always stay on your toes. It was a kraken that we saw earlier. All right. There's nothing else to do except catch more fish for the sushi restaurant. It's Kaji, man. It's not what I'm looking for. Nice. Portable oxygen tank. Weapon box. A hush dart. <laughs> Sleepy bye bye. Stereo puffer. Yeah, if these fishes are puffed up like that, nothing hurts them. Oh, I ran out of ammo. It's already asleep. Never mind. Silver ball. And I see a parrotfish. Nice, here it is. Ammunition. And another oxygen capsule. Gotta find more of these blue shells. Ah! What just hit me? Escape pod. Blue seashells. It's that asshole right there. Nice. 
Nice. Nice. R and Jesus loves me today. Oh. These are the kelps. Pink seashell. And that's an oxygen tank for later. Limestone cave. Whoa, I don't want to get pushed into those spikes. What are those? Sea grapes. Ah! What are those? Small net gun. A white spotted jellyfish. Three pieces of meat. And it's a live capture, too. That's a limestone cave. What else is down here? Oxygen tank. Oh, these are the kelps. Four out of five. And I don't have a gun to deal with that asshole. Another kelp. Five out of five. It's Bruce! Fish are friends, not food! Olive oil. A flask. That's like a trade-in item. Orange starfish. Really? I didn't pick that up. I thought I did. I always want to know why that rock is moving, and yet there's nothing I can do. It does nothing! Hey, pufferfish! this oh it's an oxygen clam don't want to go further down yet since I still got to open that cave
I'm gonna catch that Barracuda. Oh! It's too big! It's gonna bite me in the butt! We're safe. And that's an anglerfish down there, and it's marked as aggressive. What is that? It does nothing! Harpoon. Can't say no to free materials. Oh, yeah, let's see how this works. Nice. That's knocked out. And it's dead. Nope. Dead fishes yield very little meat. I need them alive. I did not understand the mechanic. I shocked myself, maybe? Cuttlefish! Triggerfish. And looks like I killed that fish right there. It's dead. Oh no, never mind. It's still alive. What's in here? Another harsh dart. And it's a level two. What's in here? Leg bone. That's what I need. Sort by weight. Cuttlefish is worth four kilograms and it's alive. This one is just five pieces of meat, but this one is just rank two. Two star, and this one's a three star. Oh, I don't want to throw these out. Spotted jellyfish tentacle. They got a whole bunch of these kelps that I don't even need. Well, I'm not so sure if I'll be able to give me the option to sell them. Stary buffers. Need to serve that to my customers. There we go. I'm already carrying a lot of stuff, so we're done.
Nice. <laughs> applicant list. Well, there's an applicant for the Bancho Shushi hiring notice. Time to have a look see. Oh, I wasn't expecting an applicant so quickly. Let's check out who we have. This is a pretty nice resume we have here. Let's hire this person right away. Kyoko, cooking 14, serving 35, procure 15, appeal 21. Better than nothing. All right, looks like we have our first staff. Pirate staff must be placed. Okay. Staff can't be placed in the kitchen or the dining area. Add it to your kitchen to cook more quickly. Add to your dining area to serve food more quickly. As for our first staff, let's try a dining area assignment for now. Yeah, I think that should be enough to go on for now. I'm saying the obvious, but things will get tough without staff to help once more customers start coming in. There's also a training to consider, besides hiring. That's all for now. Ah, training. What do we train her with? 150? Nah, not yet. <sighs> well, we do have a spot open for a kitchen. Let's see. Flyer ad. There we go. Let's see who we get. Research. Agar Tokorokin. Salt grilled red tooth trigger, trigger fish. Boiled yellow black fusilier. Seasoned kajime. I got a lot of kajime on me. recipes culinary researcher unlocked what the thought I collected a lot of kajime I could have sworn Yellow black facilier, plenty of soy sauce, red two triggerfish, agar and soy sauce. Okay. Imagine a sushi chef preparing fish like that for you. That is wild. I don't want to over prepare, but then again, I have a lot of variety. Oh, 
Uh huh. All right. We're gonna sell this. Sell the head. Sell that. Sell this. Well, everything looks good. Land open. Looks like we ran out of something. Swap for something else. Whoa! There we go! Woo, that was busy. Profit margin slightly lowered. Could have gone worse. It's Dr. Bacon. Good morning. Sorry I couldn't come by yesterday because of the symposium. Did you speak with Cobra? <laughs> oh, kind of think of it. I got material since Cobra said he was repairing a drone yesterday. Oh, a bit late, aren't I? Ha ha ha. I repaired the drone just fine thanks to you. I got some supplies as well. Here's the bombs you asked for. Also... Oh, thank you. Dr. Bacon, will these do? Alright, let's head back to that rock pile. Oh, wait. I'm finished. Starting today. The corporate shop is officially open! Mm. Huh? What is that? Ha ha ha! Deliveries have stopped, but with the drone in working order, I can transport three types of items in a day! Talk to me and select the corporate shop to see a list that changes every day. Also buy some stuff you don't need. Check out the sell tab as well. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling you'll charge high prices, but it's nice to be able to prepare. <laughs> Ha ha ha, I won't charge high prices just because I got the only business here, so don't be afraid to visit often. I feel like you let your business tactic slip just now. In any case, it's time to head back to the rock pile where the signal from the sea people was detected. Cobra shop. Oh, we got a phone call. I forgot to tell you something. What is it, Miss Yoshi? When you hire more employees and purchase more ingredients, you have to take care of many things all at once. So I decided to give you a management app, which works on your smartphone. You can check the current situation of Bancho Shushi at any time using it. You can check the status of your restaurant without visiting it. 
Brush it off. That sounds handy. Come in. I already linked the app. Why don't you check it on your smartphone? Yeah, you don't hear. I am sure Bancho Shushi will grow bigger and prosper. All right. Ah, uh, just in case there's something worth documenting inside. How about taking this underwater camera with you? A camera? That's right. It will be important for research to record important data with photos. Take the camera and I'll let you know when I find the right place to use it. Now we go to the rock pile. The management, though. <sighs> so the top sails was a long nosed saw shark and a Mediterranean parrotfish. Ingredients owned. It's a seri puffer fish, and yet I can't prepare it because it's already poisonous. Turn that in. Turn that in. Turn that in. Okay, I gotta collect five seaweeds and get even more fossils. More shells. Jellyfish, red lionfish, gotta kill those, and starfishes. Gotta get the harpoon gun. There we go. I don't have this. <laughs> yeah, this weapon guy is such a weeb. Yoshi and Sato. Cooks the to do list. Sunny, sunny, sunny. What do I do with the shop? Uh huh. This one is a trade in item. Small flask for holding something. Luckily, it isn't broken. Silver bowl, that's a trade-in item. Harpoon gun to a shark harpoon gun that's gonna cost a pretty penny. Okay. I just realized what time it is, considering that I am having too much fun with this game. Wow. I gotta get myself ready for babysitting duty tomorrow. Okay then. Well, that was fun, chat. I enjoy this game. This is pretty fun. I like it. 10-10, recommend. It is so calm. So chill, so calm. Ah, <sighs> this is where I gotta say goodnight. Yep, but worry not. We're gonna read out of someone. So let's see who is online. Who would be my friend? Let's 
Really? Cat is still streaming? Let's see who else. My god, this girl is a gremlin. Her subathon is still going. Well, let's go ahead and read out to her. Here we go. The Black Cat. Not just any Black Cat, she is THE Black Cat! And she is playing Monster Hunter World, and it looks like she is taking on a stinky monkey. So let's go on over ahead and hype her up. Yep, I'm just gonna go ahead and copy-paste these things. Maybe I got it working right, since Stream Elements didn't want to work. Okay, here we go. Yep. After party raid! Let's go ahead and copy paste that. Or what Frosty Tools have to say about her. Either one of those two. Yep, yep. So go on ahead. Thanks for watching, chat. This music is already putting me to sleep. I'm tired. It's late. GG's all around. Thank you for watching. Good night. See y'all later.